to TerraSpatial. In this video tutorial, I'll be showing you how to download aquifer system, aquifer's depth, aquifer's thickness, and aquifer's material from WRIS India website. So this data is available for India. Uh, you can download in raster file format. Now open your browser and just type in WRIS India. Now search. So you can see the first result India WRIS. I'll be sharing this uh, link in the description. You can check it out. Now click on this link and let us begin our data collection. So now you can see this is the website. Now go to the water data and here you can see groundwater and groundwater exploration. Under that you can find aquifer dispersion 2013. Click a new page will be opening up. So this is where we are going to download our data from. So they have given us the user guide. If you want you can click here, uh, click download and know more about this uh, page. Now I'm just closing this. So as you can see in the display this is nothing but the aquifer systems in India and you can see here the principal aquifer systems in India they have been given some charts. So let us uh, you can see find address here you can input the place and you can directly look for the data for example here I am going to type in Kerala and now I am going to so within a few seconds uh, as you can see here we are getting some results so I am going to choose Kerala India it is automatically going to the search location Kerala so now I am going to close this so this is the Kerala and uh, you can see the aquifers system aquifer system consists of these materials as you can see here now you can also select like this based on state so I'm going to select Kerala so once I have selected Kerala you can just see the chart view has been updated principal aquifer system in Kerala it is showing us what percentage it is there you can click over here and you can download this image so I'm going to download this image if you want you can download it in any format let me download it in a JPEG format so the image has been downloaded let us have a look at it so in the principal aquifer system in Kerala you can see this and all it's composed of these and all materials so now let me close it if you come down you can also find the principal aquifer system uh, that's in Kerala. You can see the, uh, the units. You can see the aquifer type and thickness, decadal average MGBL. Likewise, it goes on. If you want, you can download the statistics by clicking over here. You just need to provide the purpose. Uh, you enter your name and email address and submit. The data will be automatically downloaded. So now let us see how to download uh, it in a raster file format. So now hit the button. Yeah, before that you can see here gallery, uh, base map gallery. You can choose any base map among them. So I'm just uh, selecting topographic. And if you come down to the next option, layer, layer list, you can see the, let me increase the size. Yeah. You can see that uh, there are around uh, four layers aquifer system, aquifer depth, aquifer thickness, and aquifer material. So now we are visualizing the aquifer system. And if you click on the aquifer depth, you just have to click in this eye. So the aquifer depth is being shown. Uh, you can see the legend over here. So the legend must be downloaded, or you need to take a screenshot of it. That won't be, uh, uh, it is not downloadable. Just need to take a screenshot of it in order to 
identify the features. Likewise, you can see the aquifer thickness. So this is the aquifer thickness map, as you can see here. You can have the look at the legend, what it says, the thickness. Now come down, you can see the aquifer material, what material this aquifer is made of. You can see here, consolidated, archean, residual cappings, likewise. You can have view of it. Now we just go to the next step. We are going to download this uh, data sets in raster file format that we can be easily opening in QGIS. So for that select print. So first is the aquifer system. So I'm going to give the title and uh, page setup. Yeah, here we are going to just uh, select map only and I'm going to once again name it as aquifer system yeah the file format you can see a lot of file format is available so in order to work it on JS we are going to use the tip file format you can choose the width and height so what I'm going to do is that I'm just going to fit this uh, So I'm going to just zoom it or I'm just, I'm going to just fit the area of interest. So you can see here, here I'm just interested in Kerala. So I just, uh, in order to download this, we need to keep it in a visual way. So I'm just placing it in the center like this. And you can see the option, advanced option. You can set the scale DPA. I'm going to set the DPA as 250. Now you can see the option export. So within a few seconds, the layer will be exported. Let us wait for it. So you can see here now the data is ready for download. Just click on here. The data will be downloaded. So you can see here the data has been downloaded successfully. Let us have a look at in QGIS how it looks like. Now you can take a view of this uh, downloaded image. If you want to increase the DPI, you can increase it. The image will be much more clearer. You just have to keep it in mind. You just have to download those uh, legends in order to correctly identify the features. Now the same procedures. Once again, go back to the layer list. And here, I'm going to select aquifer depth. So aquifer depth. Try to keep your area of interest within this frame uh, so that it can be it will be downloaded correctly. Otherwise, it will it will be going beyond. So now we have uh, selected the aquifer depth. Same procedure. Print. Here you can change the name to depth. Select uh, the uh, file format TIFF. Let me increase the DPI to 300 and uh, select export. If you come down, you can see here it has been processing. So now it's ready to download. Let us download it. So the file has been downloaded successfully. Likewise, you can download uh, download it for the aquifer thickness and aquifer material. We just have to change the layer print thickness don't forget to take the screenshot of this legend export let us download it finally We are going to download the aquifer material. Just try to fit into the frame. 
print material export yeah it's ready to download so we have successfully downloaded it let us view it in the QGIS so now go to the option layer add layer select add raster layer now we can select the rest of these layer which we have downloaded let me click open and add it so this layers has been added successfully so this is uh, archifier thickness so one of the map is not being properly downloaded so you can see here this is aquifer material and this is depth so likewise you can download it pretty much easily just keep this in the correct frame so that it will be coming out properly so thanks for watching if you have any other doubts please do ask in the comment section Thanks for watching Terra Spatial. Goodbye everyone.